gonna start off by throwing my favorite Lucky Craft, the Super Glow MS MKB. So it's got the brown top, the magic scales, got some flash, and the pink bottom. A nice roll here in between sets. Good time to make a cast. Gonna try to cover that water thoroughly. Oh, there's a fish. Oh my gosh. There he is. Oh man. I gotta keep the line tight. He's swimming towards me, I think. But yeah, we got one. Oh, and he's running. Um, if I get this guy in, it's gonna be a decent fish. There's some weight on him. I uh, made a nice strong run. He's moving in now. Oh boy. This is not a ray. Oh my gosh. It's a big croaker. Wow. It's a big yellowfin croaker. Holy cow. Yeah, it's a chunk croaker. And he's fighting to the very end. Oh my goodness. This is the biggest yellowfin croaker I've ever caught. It's almost a 19 inch croaker with the mouth fully closed on the zero. Uh, about 18 and a half solid. All right guys, almost a 20 inch, it's a, or almost a 19 inch yellowfin croaker caught with the Lucky Craft Flashmino 110. I've got him on the slow roll uh, with the Lucky Craft and uh, super rewarding guys to uh, get that bite and get a quality fish like this. Man, this guy's so fat. What an amazing, amazing opportunity to catch fish. Let's get this guy back on the water and try to catch some more. Oh, there's a fish. Oh my gosh. I think it's another croaker and it's another good sized one, man. Um, he hit that thing hard. That was a jerk bait bite right there, guys. Uh, I hope, let's try to keep him buttoned here. I don't think I have him hooked very well. Uh, he's right here right now. Uh, yeah, it's a Corbina. Croaker's here, and wow, it's a small little Corbina. Holy cow, look at that. Hammered the jerk bait. Small little bean, less than 15 inches, fit the jerk bait. We're gonna try to keep going fish, man. There seems to be fish eating right now, but super cool, man. Corbina, wow. Oh, fish on, guys. Let's go. Shaking his head like crazy. Not as big as the last one, but he's decent. It's a Corbina again. No, it's a small croaker. So much fun, these guys. Oh, I got a perfect little hook set on this one. All right, guys, lucky craft. All day, guys, all day. Uh, third fish today, second yellowfin croaker. Um, on the jerk bait, so super fun fight. This one's a lot smaller than my last one, but still super grateful. So let's keep this, let's keep this bite going. Let's try to get some more. I'm gonna get this back in the water. Super Glow MSMKB, Lucky Craft. Fish on. This one feels like a halibut. Yes, sir. This hole is holding. Oh, baby. It's a better sized fish. He's not fighting like the previous croaker but he's got weight it's a corbina i think yeah chunky corbina this is a better size corbina oh there he goes oh my goodness it's a better size corbina it's funny i've been trying to catch corbina for the past month in the conventional light line way and i've been unsuccessful and I, this is my second one good size bean Maybe an 18. All right, guys, second Corbina of the session. Like I said, been skunking out on Corbina with a light line way um, for the past month, and I get two this morning on Lucky Craft. Go figure, man. Lucky Craft gets everything. This has been the lure of choice. I got the needle nose on there still, but um, all all morning, four fish on the Lucky Craft. Super Glow MSMKB. Let's catch some more. I'm greedy. <laughs> Oh, fish on, guys. Yeah. That's oh, a halibut. Look at him. This guy's fighting on the on top. I'm just dragging him on top. It's a little guy. 
So I didn't get a halibut yesterday, and it's a tiny halibut, but we'll take them. Oh, fish on, guys. Got him. I think it's a croaker. I caught one here yesterday, too, right at the edge of the hole. It's not a big fish, but uh, I'll take any kind of bite, you know what I'm saying? Let's see what we got here. It's a Corbina again? Holy cow. My third Corbina in two days on the jerkbait. So there he is, guys, on the electric onion. All right, guys. Corbina, halibut and Corbina today on the Lucky Craft. Thanks for letting me catch you, buddy. All right, guys. Got a little short, little halibut on the Lucky Craft Flashman, Lucky Craft Flashman of 110. The blue pink sardine, man. I really love this pattern. Probably about like 17 or 18 inches. Woo! Flashman of 110, guys. Gets bit. I got a fish on, guys. I wish I had the camera. I'm missing all my footage today. Got another short halibut on. Second halibut and I missed the strike again. This one's a little nicer. Number two on the day. This one is not illegal, but it's getting a little better. 20 inch halibut, a couple inches short, but still super fun on the Lucky Craft Cherry Berry. Flashman 110. Cherry Berry is a go-to color. Make sure you pick one up if you don't have one already. Just got him on the slow roll, um, using the occasional rod twitch upwards. Let's get this guy back in the water and let's try to catch one more. Flashman 110, baby. Let's go. Oh, on. Yeah. What the heck? Right that edge, yeah. <laughs> Dude, that was nuts. <laughs> 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 on the lucky craft cherry berry all right guys uh short halibut 18 19 inches on the cherry berry we're gonna try to get a couple more um but he been on a slow roll there you go off you go Look at that guy. We're just gonna try to release him here. Holy cow, shocked me. The hole's really nice, there's some eelgrass stacked in here. So I was trying to go as far out as I can, but it looks like they're right at my feet. I hooked onto something, I don't feel any head shakes. But it's coming in like it's a big lump of fish, but... Oh, it is a halibut. Number two. Holy cow, he's not even fighting. I barely got him hooked. It's bigger than the last one. Second one out of that hole, guys. Holy cow. So this is in 15 minutes, guys. Barely got him hooked. I don't know if he's going to stay on. We'll try. This guy's been caught before. He's damaged. All right, let's try that again. Oh, again, back to back cast. It might be big barred surf perch. Cause I caught some perch here last time. Or is it a yellowfin croaker? Yeah, big perch. Wow, this is what I'm talking about. Mommy and daddy perch. This is a keeper size. This is uh, maybe 10 inches or so. Back-to-back -back casts, and they're big size perch schooling up right here. So I got them on the blue pink sardine, and I'm used to catching these guys in the central coast and up north, but it's some big perch, man. Heck yeah. Let them go. Oh, fish on. Oh, he's running. Oh my gosh, guys. This might be the one we've been trying to get. Holy crap. I think he went in some structure, but I got him. 
Oh, I think he's stuck in structure. I hope he doesn't get cut off. Oh, come on, baby. He's still shaking. Oh, this is a big fish, guys. I steal him in there. He's not running, I think. Oh, there he goes. We got him out. Yeah, we got him out. There we go. Got him out of the structure. Let's get him out of there. Oh, baby, this is what we've been waiting for, guys. This guy's got some serious weight. This is the biggest fish I've hooked from the surf in a long time. Oh, please let me see you. Oh, it's a huge sand bass. Wow. Oh my goodness. This is a beast. Oh my gosh, that's a borderline 20 inch sand bass, guys. Yeah, mouth closed. Like 19 and a half. 19 and a half inch sand bass. Oh my goodness. Woo, look at this guy. 19 and a half, almost 20 inch sand bass on the Lucky Craft. To open to some structure. I gotta get this guy back on the water and I'll tell you know let you know what I'm doing. But man, stoked man, huge sand bass, personal best by far guys. Woo! Super stoked. Oh fish on. Yeah. Fish on. Let's see if he stays pinned. I don't know how well he's hooked. The elephant croaker. Nice. Oh, fish on, guys. Yes, sir. We're not done yet, baby. Woo We're not done yet. What is this? He's not fighting, it's like a wet trash bag, so maybe it's a small halibut. Yeah, really small. Third halibut of the session. Number three on the Lucky Craft Flash Minnow 110. Third halibut. There he goes. Let's try to get a couple more. Try to keep it slow as possible, and we're giving it some pop to provide some uh, erratic action on the lure. There are, there is some action going on here. There are signs of life here. Oh, there we go, got him. Oh, and he's pulling drag. There we go. I think he followed me in. What do we got here? It looks like a croaker, yellowfin croaker. Oh, it's a, what is this? It's a bass? Try to keep the line tight. Oh, wow, look at this. This is the Chunk Bar Surf Perch. Holy cow. It's a big perch. Oh, biggest perch I've caught in Orange County, that's for sure. 13 inches. Whoa. Not bad. Yeah, he's swimming. He's pulling drag. Fish on, guys. Fish on. Good one? Ooh, that's a honey! Out of nowhere, guys. Might be illegal. <laughs> Woo, guys! That's illegal. Yeah, that's illegal. Nice. Yeah. Yes, sir. Woo! All right, guys. Got a legal halibut, man. Just barely on the 22. Uh, got one on the Cherry Berry, the Lucky Craft Flash Minnow 110. Got him on the slow roll as usual with the occasional pop. Um, it's an outgoing high tide. It's just slacking out now and uh, was able to get this one to bite. So super, super stoked. Got to be grateful for every single fish, guys. And uh, just goes to show you, man, you never know until you cast. So uh, super stoked about this one. And uh, we'll go ahead and let this guy go.
Oh, there's a bite. Fish on. Man, I, I thought I was going to skunk today for sure. It's not a big fish, but still. Man, just stick with the process, guys. Let's see what this guy is. No eyes yet. My guess is a small halibut. What do we got here? Oh, it's a pretty decent perch. Yeah, man, we've been catching perch here. Got him on the gill plate. I don't know if that counts as a catch. He was swiping at it. But a pretty decent perch. Man. Broke the skunk with a little perch, guys. Well, let's see if there's some more. Oh, no skunk. It's been over an hour of fishing. Oh, there we go. Oh, yeah. Fish on. Please stay on. I've been losing so many fish. Please stay on. <laughs> Small halibut. Oh my gosh, I thought I was worried about skunking today. That's actually okay, huh? Well, my friend Josh is here and he has confirmed to me that it's not illegal. So we're just gonna get this guy unbuttoned and let him go. Fish on! Oh, he's pulling. It's a decent sized fish, whatever it is. It's a halibut. Another short. There he is, guys, on the Super Glow MSMKB. Oh! Josh is on! <laughs> yes, sir! All right, we doubled up, guys. I got one on the Super Glow MSMKB. Josh got one. That's probably legal on the MS Anchovy. Heck yeah, dude. Hey, Josh Bailey of Big Lout Fish, been drinking and fishing, double up. Josh got the bigger one. I wouldn't have it any other way, guys. Let's go, let's get him back. <sighs> Mine's gone, Josh is gone. Hey, double up on the halibut. Doesn't get any better than that. Fish on, guys. Oh, it's pulling, man. Wow. He's pulling. He was pulling quite a bit of drag. Now he's slowly moving in. He's got to keep the line tight and hope to beach him. Move back with the tide. Not illegal. It's a short halibut, but a very, very feisty halibut. All right, there she is, guys, on the um, Super Glow MVP. And uh, she hit small and skinny, but still super grateful and super fun. Fish on. Yeah, it's another small one. Now he's surfing across. This one's even smaller. Oh, it's tiny. Man, what it is about these feisty fish? That's four halibut today, guys. It's a fun little session. Oh, it's a fish. Got him. There we go. Feels okay, he's shaking. I think it's a small halibut. Didn't bite big, but he's fighting okay. Let's see if we can get eyes on this guy. I think it's a small halibut, be my guess. He's shaking, shaking, shaking. It's not tiny. Oh, there she is guys on the Super Glow MSMKB. Yeah, just a short, less than 20, uh, 19 and a half. There she goes. There we go. Fish on. I set the hook on that one. Do you guys see it? Let's see if he stays pinned. <laughs> Doesn't feel as big, but he's coming in. I'm guessing a short halibut. I feel some head shakes, so it could be a bass. 
All right, guys, there he is on the Super Glow MS NKB, guys. All right, buddy, there you go. Oh, it's got short bit. There we go. On. On the lucky craft, guys. Oh, he's pulling. Let's take a look here. Oh, he's illegal. That's a legal halibut. Holy cow. He wasn't even fighting. Almost home. Yeah. Legal, yeah? Yeah, for sure. All right, guys. Legal halibut. 22 and a half. Almost 23 inch. And we're going to hurry up and try to let this guy go. And I'll tell you guys what I was doing and uh, how I was able to get this guy. There he goes. I pitched a little shelf. Uh, the water's a little higher than I'm used to fishing it, but the fish are up closer, man. Maybe 20 feet, the hole right in front of me. I felt him short bite it. I paused, he came back. So um, got him on the Super Glow MS MKB. My favorite lucky craft. But really it's, you know, the patterns catch the fishermen. Um, it's all about how you're retrieving it and how you're having that thing swim in the water. It worked out for me this time. Slow roll with some little pops. Literally, we're like 15 minutes into fishing. Let's see if we can have some more. And uh, let's see let's see if it can turn into just a memorable, epic day. Let's go, guys. Oh, fish on, guys. Yes, sir. He's biting. What is he? What do we got here? It's a small halibut. Loosen that drag. I want them too tight as I drag them in. All right, guys. Got them on this new Spanish mackerel color. Uh, I've had this color for a long time, just never thrown it. It's got some damage on the dorsal fins there, but we're gonna go ahead and let him go real quick. Oh, on! What the heck? Uh, I'm not sure yet. What the heck? What do we got here? Little shore halley? The nursery. I broke off. Oh, 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 oh! I got bit right next to my feet and it's a bigger fish, guys. Oh my gosh, it's a bigger fish. Oh, it's a big old croaker. Wow. Dude, he hit like a freight train. It's a decent sized croaker. Thanks for letting me catch you, buddy. There's a fish. There's a fish. Got him. He's pulling. Gonna keep pressure on him. He's taking drag. Oh, wow. Oh, he's taking drag. Come on. Oh, he's pulling. Come on, baby. Come on, please stay pinned. I, I just felt one of the hooks shake loose. This is a good quality fish, guys. Love to get eyes on him either way. What do we got here? Oh, it's a big old bass. Holy cow, it's a big old bass. Man, look at that guy. Good size sand bass on the Super Glow MSMKB. 18, 18 yeah. solid. Yeah. 18 yeah, solid, it'll, guys. Maybe it'll pop, right? Woo! Got a nice sand bass, 18 inches, guys. Not quite as big as the one I caught a couple months ago, um, but got him on the Super Glow MSMKB. Super stoked, man. Um, and it's just about getting it out there right now. Uh, there's bait everywhere and uh, it's just ideal. Just gotta find where they're holding and wait for them to ambush. So let's try to get some more. Let's get this guy back on the water, release them and catch some more fish. Let's try to get that big halibut. Oh, the fish. There we go, he hammered that. Oh man, what is this guy? He's pulling drag. Oh, he hammered that. It's pulling like a ray guys, but I'm hoping it's not. Wow, he thumped that hard. 
Man, he slammed that thing. My lure just stopped dead in its track. I don't know what it is. Yeah, I see it. I saw it sticking out of the water for a second. What do we got here? Woo, look at him pull. Yeah, it's another leopard. My theory on this, guys, is I think he tail slaps it on purpose to try to kill it, to kill, kill the bait. But I'm not sure. That's why this guy's taking so long to bring in, because I got him by the tail. Looks like a similar size leopard that I caught yesterday. It might be the same one, to be honest with you. Oh, look at this leopard shark, guys. Um, snapped him by the tail. I, I don't know. Let me, let me know what you guys think. I feel like he might have slapped at the, at the Lucky Craft someone by to try to get it, but I'm not sure. Um, but beautiful fish. All right, guys, let's let this guy go. Um, thanks for letting me catch you, buddy. And uh, we'll talk more. Oh, it's a fish. On the slow retrieve. Nice and steady. Wow, it's another shark. This one's tiny. Look at this. Little leopard shark. Off you go. Oh, fish on. There we go. Right in this little hole. And that might be a short little halibut. Oh, he's going on the run now. The weight of him is not very big. He's feisty though. Got right here in this little hole. There we go. Maybe like an 18. Fish on, guys. So my goal is not to catch today. I was trying to find fish for Dominic, but at least we know there's something holding in the surf today. Uh, nothing huge, but a fish is a fish. Croaker, I think. Croaker Stoker. Sweet man. But anyways, uh, catch right there. <laughs> On. Small though. Oh, he's pulling. Oh, he's pulling. See, I gotta catch up to Dominic, so I have to catch one. If I land this one, it'll be two to two. Small though, he's small. Whatever it is, super small. Oh! Oh, so there are some halibut here. <laughs> like what, eight inches? <laughs> it's all good. All right, Dominic brought the good juju for me this morning. I skunked here a week ago, but um, catching some here. Fish on. Got him again. Oh, he's pulling now. Come on, baby. Second chance at life. Please hang on. Oh, he's pulling hard. Got to keep the line tight. Oh, no, it's a huge perch. No, what is this thing? It's a big yellowfin croaker, guys. Gonna loosen the drag to be able to play the current a little better. Yeah, it's a toad. Toad croaker. There's some big croaker hanging out here, guys. Yeah, the last one was way bigger. This is a, still a good size, but the last one is way bigger. I'm guessing in the 20-inch range. This one is over 15, maybe 15 or 16 or something like that. Good size fish on the Lucky Craft Flashman 110. Got him at uh, 16 and a half inches. All right, guys. Uh, got him, man. I lost one a lot bigger. Um, I lost one a lot bigger, uh, maybe five minutes earlier. I saw a dolphin swim through. I thought I was into the bite, but um, this one hit on a super slow retrieve. The water's so calm. I feel like I can do whatever I want with this thing. But again, uh, from the beginning of the video, finding the structure, hitting the spots,
coming up with the plan, adjusting as necessary, and uh, just continuing to rinse and repeat until it works off, guys. Have a plan and it'll pay off in the long run. Let's try to make this an epic day. Let's go. Oh, there's a bite. Oh, and it's another good fish. Oh my goodness. No, it's a smaller one, but this is fun, dude. Small little yellowfin croaker. There you go. All right, that's two. Two for three so far, guys. Let's see if we can keep improving that percentage. But man, fish are biting. So I want to check out other spots, but I don't think I want to quite yet because it seems like they're holding right here. There we go. Oh, fish on. Oh my gosh. They're schooled up. Number three. Oh yeah, it's a toad. I think it's worth the measure, guys. It's a toad. Holy cow. Woo, look at this guy. I'm guessing 16 again. Yep, 17. It's bigger than the last one, 17 inches. Maybe some change. Woo, it's a hot bite, guys. 17 inch, 16 and a half inch, and a smaller one. Three fish in like 15 minutes, maybe less. We're gonna try to get some more. Let's get a quick release on this guy. Woo, the bite's so hot guys, we gotta keep going. Lucky crab flash minnow and it's just it's just destroying them right now guys. We gotta get them get some more. Let's go. Oh that one's big! Holy cow, this one's big! Oh my gosh! That was a lucky crab jerkbait fight. He hammered that! Holy cow. Okay, he's moving in. Oh, let me see you. Let me see you. Definitely a toad. Oh my gosh. All right, guys. On the Flashman 0110, second straight 17 inch yellowfin croaker. Ew. So this is like a little rip. We have a little lull in the wind and the surf swell. So I'm gonna cast right now. So we're right through this hole. Nice and steady. There we go, fish on. It's so rewarding to find fish, to put in the time and have it work out. Yeah, it's still like a, a solid yellowfin croaker. Oh, there we go. Probably like a 15. That's the first cast into this hole, so hopefully there'll be a whole bunch. The current's north to south, so I'm casting on the north side of the hole, letting the current take my lure into the hole. Nice and slow. Let's see if there's, oh, right there, again. Holy cow, two straight casts. Oh my gosh, woo Let's go! That's what I'm talking about. Smaller football again. So again, right now, we just want to catch as many as we can. And we're just gonna, we're just gonna catch them, dehook them, get them back in the water, ASAP. Here we go. There's a fish, fish on. This one is not fighting like a croaker. This one might be a halibut. What is this? He's not fighting like a like a croaker. He's not fighting, but he's I can feel him. What is it? It has weight on him too, man. What is this thing? It's not a ray. I'm gonna walk up with him. See if we can get him beached. This might be a pretty big halibut, guys. I still haven't seen him. You always want to get eyes on him to know what you might lose. <laughs> halibut. Big halibut. Holy cow. Big halibut, guys. Big halibut. Oh my gosh. Please don't lose him. He's not hooked very well, guys. This is, might be a 30. It was a subtle hit. 
We're gonna be patient with them. I can't seem to move them here, but I'm gonna try to be patient. Come on, let this fish be the one. Come on, baby. Oh, this is huge. Let's go! inches 32 inches let's go oh my gosh oh my gosh guys a 32 inch halibut out of nowhere it was croakers all day and i was perfectly fine with that this guy's going home with me personal best by far 32 inch halibut hit the lucky craft flash minnow uh super glow mvp i'm so stoked right now man came out of nowhere who knew January 2022. Hal, this one's gonna be hard to beat for the year. Oh my gosh, I'm so stoked right now, guys. Woo! Oh, on! Fish on, guys. Woo! What do we got here? Halibut. Yes, it's, I think it's the same one as yours. <laughs> oh, another one. Dude, hopefully this isn't a snag. He bit right up close. I think he followed me. Not a snag. Oh, it's a croaker. Got a little one on the Lucky Craft Flash Minnow 110. So no halibut, but we're getting on these little, small little fish. So uh, yeah, we'll go ahead and let this one go, but got them right in the mouth on this one. Oh, there's a fish. <laughs> yeah. And he's pulling drag, guys. Oh my gosh, look at this guy. Oh, he's fighter. Yeah, he grabbed that thing. He's not a tiny fish, that's for sure. Wow, he's not, he doesn't want to come in. Keep the line tight, especially with these swells. There's a lot of rocks here. It's going to make it challenging. As always, I just want to see eyes on this guy. So good to feel that bite from the surf, guys. So good. Don't horse them. This is the last 10% that's the most challenging is uh, getting these guys in. Oh, it's a nice bat. Oh, it's a croaker. Sweet. Yeah, these croaker are so much fun to catch. Super Glow MS MKB. Good size yellowfin croaker. All right, guys. Super stoked. First 15 minutes, uh, caught breakfast. A little yellowfin croaker. Pretty good size. We'll put a tape on it. I'm guessing maybe like a 15 inch um, on the Super Glow MS MKB. Just hope we can get the fish to cooperate. Oh, there we go. There we go. Fish on. Right in that hole. Yep. Yep. Good size yellowfin croaker. The first cast into the hole. Find the structure. Find the fish, guys. First cast into this little structure. And this little guy hit. So we're not going to keep any more croaker. But we're just having fun now because we already have breakfast. There we go. Quick release. Fish on. Yes, sir. That was a slow roll. I don't know if you guys noticed, my rod tip was down, um, lowering, because there's a hole here. And so just uh, 
letting that lure swim a little bit lower and something swiped at it on a steady retrieve. Might be a halibut, guys. Oh, it's a halibut, guys. I think it's a short. Hey, I haven't caught a halibut in a long time, man. Super stoked. It's on a Super Glow MSM KB. This is in 30 minutes, guys. Got three fish. This, I'm not even gonna put tape on them. It's maybe like an 18. Here he goes. Quick relief. Oh, got a head shake. Oh, this is a good fish, guys. I feel him shaking. Hopefully, it's not the tail of a ray, but holy cow. It might have been the ray's tail slapping the bait. I don't know. I mean, the way he's pulling right now, I'm mean, usually rays scream. This one's not screaming. Whatever this is, is big. Yeah, I'm, you know what? That might be a big ray. But usually, rays go on a searing run. This one didn't do that. All right, we're, we're moving inwards now. We're moving inwards now. He's coming in. Ah, he's something back into there. Yeah, 99% sure it's a ray. He, now he's going back out. And he's got that side to side movement now, carrying me parallel to the beach. It's gotta be a ray. I see the silhouette, I don't wanna spook him, so I'm standing back and just gonna coax him in and hope that I don't fall into a hole. Yep, 100% ray. Bye bye, Mr. Ray. Oh, there we go. Fish on. See if he stays pinned. Oh, there he goes. Screaming. So that cadence really paid off. And I think it's a croaker. Um, and a decent size, too. I don't know if he's stuck in structure now or what, because he's not, he doesn't want to move. Maybe it's a hell of it. If it's a hell of it, it's bigger than the one I caught this morning, but that's not saying much. <laughs> yeah, this is a this is a decent fish. Yeah, look at this guy. Wow, there he goes. This is a decent fish, guys. Oh, it might be a ray again. Holy cow. Didn't feel it felt definitely felt like a fish to start, but now I'm not sure. Oh, it's a shark. It's a leopard shark. Cool, man. We'll see if he tail slapped it. Yeah, I think I probably got on my tail again. So every leopard I've caught on the jerk bait has been tail hooked, every single one. Yep, got him on the tail. It's part of why, part of the reason why they fight so good, even though it's a smaller model. All right, guys. Uh, tossing the luck craft, total grind today. Um, and it's not really turning out the way I was hoping, but there's something around. Got a little leopard shark. Always fun. Got him by the, got him on the tail, and every leopard shark I've ever caught um, has been uh, hooked by the tail. But we're gonna let this guy go and uh, try to catch some more fish. Got a strike. There we go. Fish on. Set the hook on that one, and hopefully he stays pinned. Oh, it's a drag puller. It's a drag puller. Oh, and it's definitely a fish, not a ray. So set a chance at redemption here, and he's definitely fighting, and uh, right in that same zone, guys. Oh my gosh, he's a puller. Could this be one of those days? Well, let's get this guy in. I cannot make ground on him right now. Holy cow. It's a good fish. Oh my gosh, she's going way out. Woohoo! What is this thing? Oh my gosh, I don't know if you guys can see this. He's taking a lot of line off the spool. I mean, I felt that thing thump. This is a much bigger species of something than the first one I hooked. So if I could land this, I'll take this one over the first one any day of the week. Yeah, he's coming in now. I saw a white flash. It might be a white sea bass, guys. I think it's a white sea bass, guys. Doesn't look like illegal. I, I mean, I saw the stripes. So, yeah, it's a white sea bass. It's a white sea bass.
Barely hooked, guys. Barely hooked. Look at all that salad gunk down there. I don't know, he might be illegal. White sea bass on the Lucky Crab. Flashman on 110. Let's go. Yeah, short at uh, 26. Almost 27. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness, guys. Let's get this guy back on the water. Uh, caught on a Lucky Crab Flashman on 110. Uh, 26, almost 27 inch white sea bass. Thank you so much. I haven't caught you in a long time. Let's get you back safe. Woo! I've been fishing for five minutes, uh, maybe less than five casts. Uh, got missed a small fish on the very first cast, and then a few casts later, something thumped, went on a run. It was a juvenile white sea bass. We got, got him back on the water pretty quick. Um, he looked like he swam off pretty safely. Um, the Lucky Craft Flash Minnow 110, uh, Super Glow MS MKB. Just a slow, steady, steady retrieve, some pops to give that thing that erratic diving action and some pauses to give a chance for a fish to strike. And so super, super grateful to find that tug. I think there's more out there, guys. Let's go get them. We're gonna try. Let's make it happen. Is that a fish? I didn't even feel him strike. Yes, there's, that's a fish. It came, it bit right at the swell. Oh, it's a halibut, little short halibut. Wow, I wasn't expecting that. It was at the end of my retrieve. This guy took a chomp as a swell was coming through, so I didn't feel it because of the wave. But as you can see, he engulfed his front hook. I think we'll be able to get it out, yep. There we go, guys. Phoenix, tri uh, Phoenix Trifected Light, Super Glow MSN KB. Short little halibut. Nice. Fish on. Better fish, guys. Yeah, this is what we want. What do we got here? Come on, baby. He's got weight on him. Feels similar to the last white sea bass I caught. Maybe it's another one. Oh, baby. We can land this one. This is a dream. Whoa. That might be a Corbina. Yeah, it's a Corbina. A big Corbina. It's a multi-species day today, guys. And generally, when you catch a Corbina on the Lucky Craft, it's going to be a better size, and this is definitely a better size. This is a chunk. Really good fish. 20 inches at least. Woo! 21 inch Corbina, guys. Um, on the Lucky Craft Flash Minnow. Fat Corbina at 21 inches. My first one of the year. Normally catch these on six pound test, four pound test. Oh, fish on. Holy crap, I think this is another Corbina. Pulling some drag. A decent fish again, guys. He's digging himself here in the structure. Moving over, moving over with this. Use the swell to your advantage. And let's see what it is. What do we got here? It's a bass. So that's, what, four species today? Small little Sandy. They're such good fighters. All bass are such good fighters, man. From Spotted Bay Bass, Sand Bass, Calico Bass. Just voracious eaters. I haven't got a bite in a while, so very, very grateful for this one. Thank you for letting me catch you, buddy. Oh my God. There we go. What is this thing? Swiped, I thought I missed my third bite and then got him at the very end. He came back for it. Yep, you little yellowfin croaker. That's what's swimming through here. Oh no, it's a big perch. Holy cow. Little 12 inch perch guys to beat the skunk on Matt's Lucky Craft. Thank you for letting me use that lure again. Fish on. There he is. It's a polar. It's a smaller grade fish, but uh, something decent maybe. Dug me into some structure, but got one to stick. I don't know how well he's hooked. Let's see if we can land him. Not well. It's 
It's a better gray. Oh, it's a decent halibut. There we go, mission accomplished. All right guys, got ourselves a little halibut. Uh, maybe in the 20 inch range, we're gonna put them on tape right now. Uh, got this one on the Lucky Craft that uh, my friend Matt is letting me use. He bit on super shallow water and that's, you guys know that's how I do best.